welcome to my channel, Playing with Maserati. I'm going to be doing a Dollar Tree haul. So everything I got from Dollar Tree. So let's get into this video. I am going to take some things out the bags. And then keep doing like other bags. Because there's quite a few things. Okay, so I'm going to move this out the way. Let me first do what my daughter gave me. This is from Family Dollar. This is the Centos scented gel pens. It says try me to scratch and sniff. And it is just like a regular ballpoint pen. And it is scented. So I have a blue and a green. I want to say they were a dollar, but I'm not sure. Okay, that's the green one. And then that's the blue one. Oh, covering up. There you go. Okay, so that's the rules. The next item I bought, that was from Family Dollar. Now this is Dollar Tree. Is the stickers. Look how cool that is. You get 29 of them from the Christmas house. So they're just Christmas ornaments, which I thought was a very cute. And that is the UPC. And that is all the stickers. This is my Christmas box that I'm going to be putting my Christmas stuff in until I'm ready to use it. So if you're wondering why that box is there. Okay, so then another Christmas house. And these are like season's greetings, happy holidays, so all different kinds of stickers. Festive wishes, merry bright, festive cheer, Christmas, merry Christmas, joy, the Christmas tree. So you get 25 of these. And it says, have a very merry Christmas. Let it snow. Ho, ho, ho. But these are all like different stickers. So when I'm saying it, not all of them are together. And then it says, fa la la, Noel, Joy. This is one sticker. So like that. Very pretty stickers. But, but I love how it does that. It gives you that shiny. And then that is the UPC. The next item I bought is this felted, like a fuzzy type sweater feel. And then this one was, of course it's a dollar, by Viola. And it's a bag, it's a gift bag. But what I am going to be doing to this is, if you watch people's videos, you will see that they make these bags into covers. So this is going to be my Christmas planner, like my disc planner cover. My, my happy planner cover. And then this should just come right off. But I wish you could feel it. It feels like a nice sweater. It's so fuzzy. And then in the back, it's just paper. So on one side you got the fuzz, and on the other side you have just the paper. It's the same pattern, but back and forth. The next item I got is from my bathroom, just to throw up on top of the shower. Of course, one dollar, and it was by the Shower Caddy Home Collection. I should be showing it probably this way because it's a little bit odd. So it's just the Shower Caddy. That's the UPC if you're interested. And for a dollar, why not? You can throw your little soaps up here or your razors. Whatever, shampoo, whatever you need it for. And it's one, two, three, four tier. So that's that one. Alright, let me dig in for some more stuff. The next item I have, which I'm so far away from talking to you, is, hopefully you can hear me, is this three quart canister. This is going to be for my rice, so I can store my rice bags, and it is, what did it say, three quart, so it's not bad, and then it tells you the, mill, the milliliters, the liters, so it's like a one, 500 milliliter, liter, and then it's, what is it, 1500, or 16, 1500, 2 liter, and then 2500. 
and then it tells you the cups. So if you need 16 cups, which is 16 ounce, two cups, one quart, four cups. So if you need cups, you can just use these. 48 ounces, six cups, and then so on. So three quart is 12 cups. So 12 cups of rice would be in here. So that's not a bad deal, especially for the price. Let me go in the bag. I kind of threw it on the floor when I came in. So that's why it looks crazy. So I picked up some more goodies. Some cheap cologne. Some pens. More notepads. Some planning items. Which I plan on doing a project with. Which will include you. It'll be a DIY project. So let's get started with the next one. So this bag had me following everything. Assured Ultra Rich Shave Cream Skin Therapy, Sensitive Skin Therapy, the Raspberry Scent. You get 9.5 ounce, which is not a bad deal for a dollar to shave your legs. That's the UPC. Okay, so the next item is these Double A, some beans, super heavy duty batteries. I do for low drain devices. So this is good. I mean, it, it works. I never have a problem with it. I don't change my remotes often, so this is good for my remotes, but I bought it for another project. So double A, and that is the UPC. And I mean, everybody's seen some bean batteries, I'm sure. So the next item, I picked up two of. One is the Farmer's Market Magnetic List Pad. So you just jot down what you need for groceries. And I just thought that was very adorable for a list pad. Again, magnetic. It's by the Farmer's Market Stationery Collection, Crown Jewels. And that is the UPC. And always save your magnetics because you can always make a bookmark this size, fold it in half, put your whatever you're going to put on there, your paper, whatever, and you have a nice bookmark. Again, the farmer's market. The next one is the Jot brand magnetic list pad, and it just says to do list. I don't like when they do the O's like this or the D. I wish they would just fill it in. And then it's got like a pie, like a cherry pie it looks like. Yeah, cherry pie. And then it says 60 sheets on this one. And I can tell you on this one. And the... Actually, this one don't even tell you how many sheets. You get quite a few sheets on this one. It doesn't say how many. But I can see. If I see it on the... I'll put it in the description. But this one you get 60. And they're all the same. And then that is the UPC. And it's the Jot brand. So it's not bad. Just a nice quick to-do list for your, your holidays or whatever. It goes to the place right there. Okay, now you got Jot 2018 calendar. You get, I believe, I think people are saying four sheets each of the calendar. Magnetic includes notepad, 3.87 inch by 8 inch, monthly page format. And I believe you get 4 each because that's too many for just 12. And then you have your notepaper. And that is that one. Sorry if you see the glitter. And then I wish it was in different colors, but that's fine. Pink is okay. This is going to go for a traveler's notebook. The next one it should be two items of. I have a black one and a blue one. And you know I have to pick my pens up. This is the Chrome Chromo Grip Ballpoint Pens, black ink, and the other one is blue ink. So this is the Ink Tech Smooth Advanced Ink, and I like it because it's the Chrome, and that is the UPC. 
But I will take this one apart just to see how it writes. How we going in there? Okay, so this is the black one. I'll just write the word black. Oh, it writes nice. No skipping, no feathering. Nice. The only problem I have right now is the pen is cold. Because of the chrome, it is cold. The next one is the blue one. I'll just leave it in there because it's cold. And that is the UPC. I don't know if I showed you the UPC on this one, but let me show it to you again. That's the UPC on the black one. And again, same thing, chromo grip. It's Ink Tech Smooth Advanced Ink. Two piece blue ink, and it's one mm point. So one mm. The next item I picked up is the Jot brand. 2018 weekly page format easy peel label okay so it doesn't matter it's a weekly planner 2018 that is the UPC so let me just do a quick flip through you have your personal page so you have all your personal information you have a 2018-19 calendar your holidays for 2018 and 19 you have your toll-free numbers, your airlines, your car rentals, your hotels, conversion table, which I mean I don't even know who uses that, your temperatures, uh, international clothing size, which doesn't really I guess pertain to us. Oh, it says American. Okay, so American on top, British and continental. And then I'm trying to do a real quick flip through, but that ain't helping. And then you have your January first. And then it's lined paper, lined boxes or whatever. Saturday and Sunday is very small. So I'm just going to flip through the back now because you know that's what it looks like. There's no, no pages until you get to the end. And then you just have one page for note. And then this was how it came. But this will be one of my traveler's notebooks. And again, that is for that one. This will be a B6 size, I believe it is. But I'll do dimensions and everything later. And then this comes off as well. So I will be just covering the book up. So this is the monthly planner, 2018. Again, jot, monthly page format. Again, you have your personal information. Same thing, 2018, 19. And I'm just doing a quick flip through. Same thing, toll free numbers, conversion, and then that is what your monthly looks like. So you have little lines. This could be your work schedule, your appointments only, because this is only your month, or anything you need to just track. So when you get to the back, you have a little note section on the side. So you have your notes here, and then you just, your calendar's there in a large format. And then, on top of it, you have more goodies. Okay, so there's your December of 2018. Then you have your 2018 overall. Okay. You have your notes section. You have a couple pages of those. So you have those. And that. And then you have your travel expenses. So, yeah, so your gas, your parking, your hotel, your meals, your tips. You just date it and then put your notes, whatever you're doing. And it's for every month. So you have 12 months of those. It looks like, I hope. Yeah, okay, so you have 12 months of those. You have another note section. those and then which I haven't seen these in a very long time you have a phone book from A through Z a lot of no pages on the back here's your Z so 
So you just have your name and address and phone number. So simple, very basic. And you fill it out, your email address, whatever you want to put there. You have more note pages, which is lined. Which this is going to be a very cute traveler's notebook. Okay, and then all kinds of note pages. I think that's basically what's left of it. Yeah, and then you have a, this won't be here, but this is going to be another DIY project. So this is the monthly one. The next item I picked up is I needed some hair bands. So I got some hair twisters. You get three pack, purple, pink, and white. Basic solutions. I like these because they don't pull your hair too much. It's not that thick of an elastic or small as elastic, whatever you want to call it. So you get three of them. That is the UPC. So just quick, put your, hair, put your hair up and that's to go. The next items I picked up, I'm going to leave at the end for those. As you can see, there's some ornaments. This fake Oscar de la Rente. So it's Ascent for women. Um, I don't think it has like a version of it. Like The version is Oscar de la Rente, but it doesn't say like Ascent. And then it's a nice size bottle. And yes, it's a generic cologne, but just to... Yes, I'm spraying it. Just to smell a little good when you're outside. I've already used it. I like picking up, like, scents. Just a quick throw it on. Especially if you're just spraying yourself. It's probably sounds weird, but whatever. Assured Twin Double Razors. So they're blade razors. Lubricating strip, stainless steel blades for women. And you get how many in here? 10 count, which is not bad. It's like 10 cents a razor. There's your UPC. And then it's just a good pack of razors. Twin Double. Okay, so the next items, I'm going to have to go in my bag. Just a few more things. Okay, so now we have some cleaning supplies I wanted to pick up. These I'll show you last because it's going to go for another project. Yeah, all these are going to go for another project. Picked up some Comet Toilet Boy Cleaner. It is the classic home cleaners. 24 ounce. I haven't seen this one there, so I picked it up at Dollar Tree. Okay. I know the same cleaning supplies, but hey, people do got to clean, right? I picked up this uh, Spa Soap Aloe and Chamomile Cream Soap. And it's just hand soap. 16 ounces, and it's a pump. And everybody loves soft soap. And that is the UPC. Alright, so I have a few more items left. Not too bad. Some more. And then I picked up Comet, just the kitchen cleaner with bleach. It's 48% more than 16.8 ounce. So you get 25 ounces. So it's just Comet cleaner. If you're interested, that's the UPC. Okay, so now I can show you why I have these items. I picked up from Dollar Tree an actual tree. So this is 18 inch high, which will be my desk tree. It has a little stand. So I'm going to make this taller. So you can see it. It's 18 inches. It's Christmas house, Christmas tree. How cute is that? Shows you how to do it. That's the UPC. For one dollar, you get a Christmas tree. Okay. So with those, I picked up a few items. 
I'll show you what I picked up from Family Dollar and Dollar Tree. So from Dollar Tree, I picked up these 16 count ornaments by the Christmas house in gold, which I didn't pick up any hooks, unless it comes with, all comes with ties. Uh, yeah, I guess it does, it comes with ties. So it's like a little tiny thing. I don't think they do hooks anymore, but whatever. So I picked up gold ones, and they're, they're not glass, it's like probably plastic. So I thought that was cute. I picked up these cute bells, which some will go for my traveler's notebook and some will go for this tree. You get 16 count decorative bells. And that sound cute when you're taking it out of your planner. And then that's that. It's got the gold top, so you have gold and red and gold and gold. And you got a 16 count. And this is the Mary by Christmas House. This is very pretty. You can't beat it for one dollar. Okay, so the next items I picked up. You, ha you can't have a tree without lights. And this is why you need your batteries. Okay, so these are clear white. And I hope I picked the right... Yes, I did. Okay, so I did pick up the right batteries. It is clear white lit LED light set. So they're just clear. And it's battery operated. I picked up two of those and I hope they're both clear. Yes. So I got two of those. And then you just put your battery in there. This is the UPC. How cool is that? The Christmas house. Okay, so the last two items I picked up at Family Dollar are these cute LED, the multi light set and the blue snowflake and yes they were both a dollar and these are leds and you have your battery pack right there and it takes and i hope it's double a um it's actually not telling me right now where it's at i'm assuming they're double a you have total length of three feet yeah, double A. It's indoor use only with an on off switch. Batteries not included. So I like these for the traditional red, blue, green. And then these are at the family dollar. And then I picked up snowflakes in blue. I think it's blue. Yeah, blue snowflakes. So I may have too many lights, so I may pick up another tree at the Dollar Tree. I just thought for my kitchen but I thought that would be cute for my desk and we'll be doing a DIY project on this so this is my haul please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't subscribed share with your family and friends comment below as always thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did and thank you for always watching bye bye